I'll tell you what, tunnel heads, I'm seeing a hunk of America. In my home state of Iowa, I saw too much of this, the Missouri River over by that power plant causing lots of Midwest misery. I adjusted my route as need be, always looking for roads that, well, the answer is not Earl. I actually saw that sign in Arkansas. I bring it up now because the Great Plains is short on twists. Here, everyone travels in a straight line. Well, there are things to break up the monotony. Does absence of fence mean those are wild horses? I'm glad the deer and antelope played at a safe distance. I saw amber waves of grain and got a little help from these nice folks in Riverton, Wyoming. And then there was this, orange clouds. Turns out I was approaching the world's largest open pit coal mine. I saw no orange clouds. And eventually, inevitably, the straight flat part ended and Mother Earth rose up on the western horizon, welcoming me with a gift. Western mountain roads don't just twist. They wind and turn through some of the most beautiful scenery this side of, well, Alaska, actually. And so there is still a lot to look forward to. I'll leave you with two quick postcards. Welcome to Sturgis, South Dakota, where the annual Black Hills Motorcycle Rally will soon attract tens of thousands of mostly Harley riders for their annual celebration of mm, body biker behavior. Sturgis reminds me of what Willie G. Davidson once told me about the similar annual migration of his customers to Daytona Bike Week. He said, quote, we all look alike, we all dress alike, we all ride the same motorcycle. And every year we go to Daytona to show that we're different. Soon Sturgis will be awash in polished chrome. So how can one manage to be different? Actually, it's not that hard. Finally, a quick visit to one of America's most beloved attractions. Up close, the Mount Rushmore of motorsports looks exactly the way Robin Miller described it on speed.com. Then again, I've been spending a lot of time out in the hot sun. Well, with that, it's back to you, boys. 3,400 miles down, the best is yet to come. Dave Despain, over and out.